Hello, it's great to be with you, and I don't think anybody is going to complain, especially about the weather. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone, and sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And what we have for you is live action from the Liga Portugal. It's Rio Ab up against Benfica. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. So the initial 11 for the home side. Well, when they don't have possession, it will be a back five. But when they win the ball back, the wing backs will push further forward to make it a 3-5-2. And this is how the starting 11 looks for Benfica. Joao Mario starts with David Neres out wide. And it's two strikers up front who will look to provide the goal-scoring threat. And the match is underway. Adelan Santos. Andre Pereira. It's a well struck pass. Crossing possibilities. Throw in here for Benfica. Under some pressure. Grimaldo. Did well to win the ball back. He's got space. And he's keen on cutting in. Rafa. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Difficult to stop him. Must take the lead here. Chance, maybe. And the keeper hangs on at the second attempt. Well, he's done really well, hasn't he? Great stop, and then the reaction. Always difficult to predict in advance who might decide a game, but you could make a strong case for this man, I think, Stuart. What are you expecting to see from him? Yeah, he's the club's leading scorer, and he's so difficult to negate. But I'm sure these defenders will have a game plan for him. Whether it works or not, we'll have to wait and see. He might be able to profit from the wide position. Rafa. It has to be. Oh, narrowly wide. So unlucky. Failed to keep hold of it. Rafa. They might be able to get in now. And the cross fired over, but no real central pressure applied. Can he find the net? And fine goalkeeping. Short corner it is. Must be! Well, that effort was always going wide. He's not going to be best pleased with himself. Yeah. 
Atenção, Gonçalo Ferreira. Gonçalo Ferreira. Já. On the ball, Andamaris. And a timely intervention. Well, as the stats confirm, Benfica have been the more dominant team over the last 15 minutes, and they're playing really well and creating chances. It's surely only a matter of time before they take the lead here. Yes, yeah, really going so well for them, and who knows, they might be able to craft another opportunity. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Rafa. David Neres clears it away. Guga Rodrigues still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Now he must favour the cross. Just the challenge that was required. Joao Mario deciding to go inside. Oh, big chance! In it goes! The opening goal in this contest! Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. once more how important will that opening goal prove to be well the electronic board showing one additional minute and with that the first half draws to a close well he's been the standout for his side so far don't you think Stuart well I'm sure the manager will be delighted with him He'll have drilled it into them to keep their focus, keep playing through to the half-time whistle, and it's certainly put them in a good position to go on and win this now. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. Rafa. David Neres. The high press was very much on. And options in the center. Andre Pereira. A chance maybe from the wide position. And thwarted there following the cross. Samaris. Well, that's really strong play to keep hold of the ball. Well, they get themselves level here. Able to clear the danger, at least for now. No way through. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. Rafa. On the ball, Florentino. Well, shielding the ball admirably. 
David Neves. Will he find the net? It's gone in! Well, they're really in the mood here. Can they be stopped? Well, here it is again, and credit to the goal scorer, but you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post covered for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. So the ball rolling again, 2-0 the score. Into the final 20 minutes. Samaris. Rodrigues. Guga Rodrigues. Andre Pereira. Well, pass after pass, maybe they can chisel an opportunity. I must say, this looks promising. A fine reading of the situation. Florentino and slipped through beautifully Rafa element of risk there but he's won the ball Guga Rodrigues this might be ideal for the counter and it looked like open road for them but up a dead end David Neres. Rafa here. Aursnes. Rafa. It has to be. And a goal to put the final stamp on it. That will do it. Well, as you can see, what an excellent back heel did up the goal. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Samaris well just one minute of time added on for stoppages here and there goes the final whistle it's gone the wrong way as far as the home fans are concerned you're absolutely right Derek while the result is poor the display was even worse they never got to grips with the opposition they were second best at every facet of the game they need to do a lot of improving before the next time out well this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance hasn't he Stuart well he gave that back line a torrid time didn't he he was far too sharp for them always looking to play on the shoulder took his goals well too clearly the difference maker today